Hey guys, so I changed the name of my channel from Coffee and Crosswords to David Does Crosswords because I really wasn't drinking coffee on this channel, I'm sorry. I do these videos late at night and I don't want to stay up all night after having drunk coffee. So that's the reason for the name change. I hope you guys don't mind. Um, I want to give a shout out to my niece who's almost two years old. Hi Madeline. Hi. <laughs> Okay, um, okay, let's move on to the Monday puzzle. And here we are, and you'll notice I have a new graphic in the corner, and I'm not sure how, I'm going to probably fix the graphics on this channel a little bit more, do a little more work on it. Uh, but anyway, let's move on to the puzzle. Ready to start ready to start solving? Yes, I am. Accessory across the front of a Girl Scout uniform. What could that be? Um, a bow? Uh, I don't know what it is. Uh, like toddlers when meeting strangers often. Maybe they're shy. Uh, sailors, yes, is I. And let's try this one. What's this? Excessively promote. You hype it up. And this one, 16, 12 month is a year. So what could this one be? Accessory across the front of a Girl Scout uniform. Um, I, don't, I don't know. Sandwiches that may save the day. Oh, heroes, nice. Uh, a sash, okay, I was kind of close with a bow. Uh, Cold War contest featuring Sputnik and Apollo. That sounds like space race. Let's go here, five. The M in Einstein's E equals MC squared. That stands for, actually it stands for mass. Uh, let's just go right across. Own up, maybe you fess up. 14 across, car, maybe that's auto. Looks like good crosses there. 15 across, airline once said to be ready when you are. Hmm, Delta, I don't know, let's, let's go here. Ship's primary canvas. Um, main sail maybe? Main sale. Mother's sister is your aunt or aunt. And uncomplaining, say. You are uncomplaining. Maybe you're stoic or not sure what that is. One of Shakespeare's one of Shakespeare's begins My mistress my mistress eyes are nothing like the sun. That sounds like a sonnet. And this one let in on a secret. And this looks like stoic. Uh, wrestler actor John, maybe it's not stoic. Let's look at that be. Cluster of feathers, maybe that's a tuft. We had tuft yesterday. Uh, bearded grazer, oh, that's an emu. And jotless, joltless javas, uh, that sounds like coffee. No, wait a second, joltless javas, what does that mean? Joltless javas. Decafs, probably. Decafs. There we go. Nine down, dread, you fear it. Ten down, John who sang Rocket Man. Of the, it sounds like Elton John. And this and that dishes are what? Slaws? Twelve down, da Stark Daughter on Game of Thrones. Um, Cersei? Cersei? Something like that. Oh, wait, what's going on here? Delta? It's not Slaws. Because it is Delta. Uh, Stews, maybe. Stews. There we go. And this is an A. Is it Sarsis? What is it? Consumed is eaten. Oh, San, San, Sansa, maybe. NSA? Yeah. Okay. And this is what? Does the name contain an animal? Yes. It is a band. It is a band fronted by... Is it a band fronted by Adam Duritz? Yes. Uh, counting... Counting... Crow oh, it's not... This is not Emu. What is this? This is uh, Bearded Grazer. Uh, bearded Grazer new? G GNU? Is that it? Yeah. Okay. County Crows. Sena. John Sena? I don't know who that is. I don't know who that is. All right. County Crows. Great. Okay. Moving on. Peaks of Waves. Uh, maybe they're Crests. And Rower's Blade is an Oar. Mm, smallish batteries are are triple A's. And let's let's do the down. Prices are costs. Twenty three down. Japanese Japanese noodle dish is ramen. And a 
crude outbuilding. Um, what would a crude outbuilding be? Uh, I'm not sure. Ah, with 45 across, does the name contain a vegetable? Yes. Is it a band fronted by Billy Corgan? Yes. Okay. Um, Billy Corgan, what is that? Uh, Smashing Pumpkins, right? Smashing and then Pumpkins. Pumpkins. Okay. Cool. Got that. Silicon Valley Field, informally, is tech. Crude outbuilding, I still don't know. Mean mocking smile is a sneer. Or is it sneer like that? Oh, a shed is an outbuilding, All right? Moist would be damp. Let's move on to al alpaca lookalike would be a llama. Oh, we have a couple things here. Long running Lorne Michaels product for one. A and L, oh wait, it's S and L. Oh, I see, double, smallish batters are double A's, not triple A's. So I should have been aware of the plural in the clue. So it wouldn't have been triple A, it would have been double A. Or it would have been, if it was triple A's, if it was triple A's, it would have been four letters long. And then here we have gap opening as a wide teeth. Yes, 40. Closed mouth is uh, mum. You're keeping quiet. Uh, food of the gods. What is food of the gods? Not sure. Uh, entrepreneur's degree, maybe an MBA. What's this one? Big nuisance is, uh, should be pest. Entrepreneur's degree, is it not? Uh, is it M Is it something like? Is it not? An, is it not MBA? Big nuisance. Um, come back to that. Boars, boars gorer. Maybe a tusk on a on a on a boar. Seaweed wrapped rolls are sushi. I know I'm going through this really fast, but opening for a coin is a slot. What else do we have here? Uh, possible response to who's there? It's me. And this one is Winnie the Pooh's craving is honey. Honey, no, honey, there we go. <laughs> a rep's opponent, maybe a Dem, Republican, Democrat. Uh, TED Talk accompaniment often, maybe the slideshow. Um, what's this one? Premium cut of steak. Sounds like a ribeye. And what is this? Ambrosia? What is ambrosia? Big nuisance is a pain. That's right, and pain. Okay, let's go down here. Speedway Sport. Um, what is Speedway Sport? Max's opposite would be Min, and Buddhist Temple is a pagoda. Like that, maybe, or is it a T? Pagoda sandwich shop is a deli, so it is a D. Okay, six fifty-five across. Adios would be Chow, I think. Speedway sport, race, just racing, okay. Uh, kitchen appliance brand, or I don't know. Let's go over here. Garment that may have an underwire, maybe a bra. Definitely a bra, <laughs> I hope. Brazilian actress, Sonia, don't know. Fez-shaped chocolates, fez-shaped chocolates. Uh, Rolos, as soon as I did that, I could picture the candy. Okay, um, part. Uh, sus suspects out is an alibi and part of the apple logo a bite a bite taken out of the logo of the apple this doesn't look right one might arrive on a saucer an alien so it's not bite what is this um, portable preparedness kit uh, don't know sarcastic I bet wait is this wrong something wrong here What's this one? Does the name contain a mineral? Yes. Is it a band fronted by Mick Jagger? Yes. Rolling Stones. Okay. And portable preparedness. What's this one? Part of the Apple logo. Okay. Um, a leaf? There's a leaf on that logo? Portable preparedness. Uh, a go bag, maybe? Or a uh, what, what kind of bag? As if, okay. And what's this? Brazilian actress Sonia Br. Is this is is go bag a thing? No. So what what is it? I don't know. Kitchen appliance brand. Um, not sure. Soul icon Otis Redding. And this one is a region is an area. Oh, Oster. Okay, Oster. And then this one, a mahjong piece is tie is a tile. 
Uh, necklace decorations are beads. And let's do these acrosses. I'm about to speak. Ahem. You clear your throat. Sick. You are... It's dope. Uh, and this one, flatten as a fly. You'd, be, you'd swat a fly. And then you had it org with pollution sol pollution solutions is an EPA is the EPA, and if you met someone you rendezvoused with them. So what is this? Is it a go bag? It is a go bag. Cool. Go bag. I never really heard of that. But there's my eight day streak. Yay me. Cool. Um, so that was a pretty easy puzzle. Um, Fun puzzle has kind of a uh, 20 questions theme. Kind of cool. All right, cool. Well, welcome to David Does Crosswords. I'm happy to have you. If this is your first time watching, please hit the like button, subscribe. Even if it's not your first time, hit, hit the like button. And uh, I'll see you in the next one tomorrow. Take care.